So I'm gonna delete the message from my iPhone and I will delete it for everyone. So if I go to my Android phone and open the chat, the text should be deleted. I'm gonna show you how you can be able to get that text message back. So just open that application that's called Notisave and there you go. Those are the two messages that I just deleted. So make sure to stay tuned to know how I did this. Hi everyone, I'm back with you with a new video and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to be able to read unsent or deleted messages from messenger. Now this is very easy, all you need to do is follow a bunch of steps and I will show you how you will be able to do that. So the first thing you need to do is go to your settings and then drop below until you see apps. Tap on apps and then again also tap on apps. For the second time, after that make sure to find the messenger application or the Facebook messenger application so just scroll down depending on how many applications you have it should be somewhere in this list once you have that application just tap on it and I will show you what to do next once you tap on it you need to go to where it says storage and after that just tap on that and you will have two options make sure to tap on clear cache not the data just the cache so then go back to your home screen and then go to the Play Store and you need to download an application. The link for that application is going to be in the description in case you're worried or you can just type here Notisave and the application should pop up in front of you. After that press on install and wait for the application to be downloaded and after that I will show you what you need to do. So I just want to mention that this application works perfectly fine on Android users or Android softwares. If you're an iOS user, I'm actually working on finding a way for that as well, so make sure to comment below in case you're interested in knowing how to do one for Android. So just make sure to comment below and I'm actually working on a way, it requires a jailbreak but it should be out soon. So while we're waiting for the application to be downloaded, it will be great if you guys hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel. That shows me that you guys enjoy the video and like it and makes me make more content similar to this. So the application is almost done downloading. After it's downloaded, I will show you what the steps are. It's pretty easy, it's nothing complicated and it can show you and help you in the future if you have messages removed or deleted from friends, from your loved ones or from whomever you feel like you need their messages to be read. Okay, so application is just installing and after that, so obviously it's downloaded and installed, all you need to do is drag the application to your home screen. I'm doing this for the sake of the tutorial to be a bit obvious and nothing, uh, let's say, nothing is complicated for you guys, so I'm just gonna drag it to my home screen. You don't need to do this, all you need to do is just open the application so you can go ahead and do the steps that are required. So after you open the application, it will show you or prompt you with a few options. Just press on next and press on allow. Now this is very important. It has to control your notifications, otherwise you will not be able. And once you toggle that application on, make sure and double check to see only that application is toggled on, nothing else, because this is all you need. So make sure to double check on that, toggle it on, and then press on allow again. And after that, just wait for your applications to load and I will show you what you need to do next. So press on next again and make sure to do this step, it's very important. Toggle the toggle on and after that toggle it back to off. So that's very important because it disables it for the rest of the application and you need to go and find the application which is called Notisave and turn it on just for that. Otherwise, all your applications will control your notifications and that's not something you want. All you need to do is just toggle it for toggle it for Messenger. Make sure to do that and that's it. After that, all you need to do is go and press on the check mark and that's it. You're good to go. After you toggle it to Messenger, just that's it. As easy as that. All you need to do is go to your Messenger and wait for someone to send a message and then delete it. And obviously, after that, you'll be able to see it. So I'm going to try it again. I'm going to send the Android device a few messages so you can see clearly and so I can show you how this works perfectly fine. So as you can see, I got the message and if I open it, you will be able to see that message that I got. So obviously, that's the message in front of you. It says hi. Now I'm going to delete that and it will be deleted from the chat. And after that, all you need to do is go to your application, which is called Not to Save and you will be able to see that message. So as you can see, I just press on remove. The message will be removed from the Android device clearly in front of you. 
all you need to do is I'm, I'm actually gonna send another message and delete that as well so for the sake of the tutorial to be 100% working I'm gonna send that message again and I'm going to delete that as well and after that you'll be able to see that message gone from the chat so as you can see I just deleted the message from Facebook or from Facebook Messenger and the message is no longer available there but if I go and open NotiSave the message is still there and that's very important this is all we need we need the messages to be saved in the NotiSave application to view them in case they are removed from Facebook Messenger so if you guys are enjoying the video make sure to subscribe to the channel because I will be making more futuristic videos similar to this so as you can see I'm gonna do another message I'm gonna send another message to my Android phone I'm gonna delete that and I will show you and you guys can see for yourself that the message is still there in notice save application this is very easy and uh, I think this is it for today's video although something else that needs to be mentioned is if you guys want to know how to recover or see deleted messages on whatsapp or on Instagram I have a similar video or similar videos for that as well so make sure to check out the links in the description the links for those videos are there and uh, you can get to see how to delete or see deleted messages on instagram and whatsapp as well so that's it thank you so much for watching and i hope you guys enjoyed today's video